For some patients with hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, the medications are not enough. And if your symptoms are still progressing and your quality of life is not where it should be, despite your cardiologist having maximized all the medical therapy, well, then we go on to some of the more invasive procedures. The one that's been around the longest is uh, what's called a surgical myectomy. And so that's open heart surgery, where the surgeons go in and shave off that thick part of the heart muscle and instantly reduce obstruction from this condition. There's another more minimally invasive procedure called an alcohol septal ablation that's done through catheters that go in the artery of your body, usually in the leg. And the doctors will inject a little bit of alcohol for part of your heart. And that causes that muscle over time to get a little bit smaller and over time can relieve obstruction as well. Both of these are effective treatments and your cardiologist can help determine which of these would be best for you if you do need one of them. Being faced with the diagnosis of hypertrophic cardiomyopathy might seem scary, but I do want to emphasize that this is a very treatable condition and we are constantly getting new medical therapies, new procedures, new diagnostic testing that have all been shown to help with this condition. That's why it's really important to talk to your doctor to make sure you're getting the most up-to-date treatment for this condition.